Uh, let's uh, let's talk to Jane. Hello, Jane. Hello. Hello. Denise hasn't got this. She's looking down at her sheet, so she hasn't got this on her sheet. <laughs> what would you like to say, Jane? Hello, Je uh, hello Denise. Hello, darling. Uh, what it actually is, is way back in 2011, I sent in an email to you, right? At that particular point, I was going through some really, really bad things in my life. I'd had somebody else involved in my marriage for a very, very long, very long time. And unfortunately, they passed away. If it wouldn't have been for what you actually said in your email, I wouldn't have two grown-up daughters at this present moment because I wouldn't be here. I actually assure you that you actually saved everybody in this house and everybody in my family from me going to somewhere that I really didn't want to go to. But if it wouldn't have been for you, and I've wanted to say so many times thank you, but I've been unable to. And to be able to get, be given this opportunity at this present moment to be able to say thank you to you is unbelievable. There you go. Oh, dear. <laughs> Hold on a second, Jane. <laughs> Hang on. That's what people say all the time. What's in that box in front of tissues? There you are. <laughs> you, yeah, honestly, it's just like, you were like this guiding light that had said these words in this email that turned around and said, just a minute, other people have been through, even though it seems so odd to you, other people have been through this. I've seen it before. There is a light at the end of the tunnel. And I'm going to show you the way. And, you know, you even sent me a personal email after everything. And it was, it made me realise, oh, there's somebody listening. There really, really is. And I'm worth carrying on for, even though I was at the depths of the worst situation that I could have plausibly been here. And we're now, what, we're now, what, four years on, and I couldn't be happier. But honestly, <laughs> if it wouldn't have been for you... I won't be here. Jane, oh. that's lovely. Thank you so much. We don't get a chance to do that very no, often. But, but I have to say, for, for you... Script, and, oh, no, sorry. no, 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 no. <laughs> hold on. We've got loads. Is, uh, my eyelashes are going to fall off There now. you go. Don't use your script. But, that's, <laughs> we, I, hope, I hope other people listening, because we've had some very sad emails in in the last few days. Mm. You, you know, it worked out for Jane, and it can work out for you. Well, the... What we do, seldom ever get the chance to say is that that's just the tip of the iceberg. Mm. We get so many people who say this about you and Dr. Chris as well. Say, you know, if it hadn't been for Chris pointing something out, um, then uh, then I would never have gone to the doctor and I wouldn't be here now. Uh, or I've been desperately worried about something and then I found out there was nothing to worry about. So, uh, so I think on behalf of everybody, thank you. Thank well, you, if I can say thank you to ITV because over all the years they've allowed me to offer that backup service. Nobody who rings in here or emails just gets, you know, mm. that's it. Yeah. It's over. So thanks all around.